Welcome to Omega. It's a place. Uh, welcome to Omega. You're new here, aren't you? I can always tell. Allow me to... Oh, hello, Mocklin. Fishman! I was just... Leave, Fargot. Now. Oh, of course, Mocklin. Whatever she wants. <laughs> she? <laughs> Blasted scavengers. Welcome to Omega, Shepard. You know who I am? Of course. We had you tagged the moment you entered the Terminus systems. You're not as subtle as you think. Arya wants to know what brings a dead Spectre to Omega. I suggest you go to Afterlife now and present yourself. I'll keep that in mind. Afterlife, now. I'm receiving quarantine warnings about the slums where Dr. Morton Solis runs the clinic. Anticipate resistance at the transport station. Okay. I've also accessed messages between mercenary groups regarding plans to deal with the Archangel. There's a recruiting station at Afterlife that may have information on him. Okay. Oh, uh, what's going on here? Please. You have to help me. No one said you could talk, jackass. You Zaid Masani? Yeah, that's me. You must be Commander Shepard. Hey, we have a galaxy to save. Who's your friend? My contacts told me we're picking up one man, not two. Batarian delinquent. Pissed off someone rich enough to hire me to go after him, and for my bring him in alive rates, even. Please, I didn't do it. I said, <laughs> shut it. Tried to leave me on a chase all over the systems. You should have known better. These people always run to Omega. Okay, well, what are you gonna do with him? What's gonna happen to him? I'm gonna turn him in for the bounty. Don't much care what happens after that. <laughs> Welcome to the shit show, man. Ah, uh, I can give him. I can get you. We'll get you a bumper sticker that says you don't have to be insane to work here, but it helps. <laughs> Good to have you, Zaid. We have a lot to do. That's what they tell me. I assume the elusive man told you about our arrangement. Uh, no, no. I guess he decided to leave that information out of the dossier. Good thing I asked. Picked up a mission a little while back, just before I signed on with Cerberus. Thought you might be interested. You heard the name Vito Santiago? He's the head of the Blue Suns. Runs the whole organization. Seems he recently captured an Eldfell Ashland refinery on Zoya, and is using their workers for slave labor. The company wants it dealt with. Okay, sure, we'll do that. I'll make sure we get that done. Good. Get it out of the way so we can concentrate on being big goddamn heroes. I better turn this thing in before it starts to stink. I'll be locked and loaded next time you're ready to get some killing done. He seems nice. Yeah, no, I think Cerberus makes good choices. Yeah, he seems like a nice guy. So now if you want to switch out one of your teammates for Zaid, you can do that if you want to. Ooh, how do I do that? Go back to your ship, that's all. Oh, really? Yep, just go walk back the way you came. Okay. Now, you could go for Archangel, you could go for the professor that you were told to come for, or you could go do Zaid's mission that he told you about just now. Let us go continue getting people from here. Yeah, picked up a couple more. The first one was easy. And also, we're gonna try and get some random things here, because there were people saying that they wanted stuff. Yeah, there might be a couple things you can pick up. I'm supposed to go to Afterlife, but I do what I want. Uh, marketplace! Yep. Got, gotta buy some stuff in the marketplace, that's true. Yep, yep, yep. Let's go to the marketplace! We need some new things so that I can make my two engineers happy. Yes, they wanted couplings and... Ooh, a mad profit! And shoot! Applies on galactic purity. You, sir! You are a blight. Okay. <laughs> you. And you. you. And you. Repent, sinners! For soon she comes! She will use her most foul hands to cleave the landscape in twain! Blood will run from the eyes of the non believers! I don't know. I Gore and viscera will fill every orifice of the entire universe, and none will be spared from her most holy cleansing fire! I like the other guy's message, I was more receptive to that, but your delivery of your message, I, I, it's very compelling, I think I, I'm compelled to follow, alright. Thank you, soon your flesh will be rent from its bones. I will be your first prophet, you may call me <laughs> Jeremiah. I might have something here for humans, not much. Mm. 
Convince me to shop here. Sell me on your products. I'm in the mood to spend some money, but I think I can find better stuff elsewhere. You won't find a better selection anywhere. Unless you're willing to risk the black market. I'd rather deal with you than give money to those thieves. You sure we can't make a deal? Look, I can't compete with the black market. I have to make a profit. I'll do what I can. But don't tell anyone or I'll lose my shirt. Okie dokie. Uh, why was that Paragon? You, you can buy uh, models you can assemble in your living quarters. <laughs> Oh, a titillating alien magazine. <laughs> oh, man. Yeah, we're getting that. Getting some born ass. That is a, that is a weird Hanar. <laughs> oh, look at the things on that Hanar. <laughs> um, uh, sure, I want to buy a model kit. You just snuck oh, in. Oh, God, what is this? Turn it down, you base heads. <laughs> <laughs> you just snuck into Afterlife the back entrance. Oh, I didn't mean to do that. <laughs> but I guess this is where we are. Hey, it's Fist. You remember that guy? No. Shepard? I heard you were dead. I had a party and everything. <laughs> no hard feelings, though, huh? No, really. Thanks for taking the time to chase a small-time crook off the Citadel so I could squat in the shithole for years. <laughs> yeah, you're welcome. And if you leave the straight and narrow, I'll be there to follow up. Right, right, because you don't have planets to save and bigger shit like that. Nothing better to do than keep me down. You're right, I don't have God anything better to do. Saviors of the galaxy, messing with a man's living. Well, he's not happy about you. Oh, well, whatever. Sounds like it sucks to be him. There's a lot of Asari on here. Uh, huh. I'm on a, I'm on a mission, but, uh... uh I'm chug, on chug. a mission, but, I mean, I always got time to throw back a few. <laughs> Hit me with a cold one! Also, I don't know what kind of alcohol batarians like you drink, but... No, pink dildo. Yeah, not my favorite. That's a little weird. Ooh, tastes like blue. Oh, wow! That... I never thought anything could taste like a color. Oh! Oh god! Oh, no! I'm dying! You just got poisoned by the batarian... Really? Bartender. Yeah. <laughs> Is that it? Is that the end of the game? Say something, Commander. Uh, I don't feel so great. <laughs> How much did I drink? One drink. That's all it takes. That racist Batarian bastard. Looks like you broke the first rule of Omega. Don't order a drink at Afterlife if you're human. So I was poisoned. That bartender tried to poison me? Tried is the word. As far as I know, you're the first human to survive it. Me and my friend Jake went there to celebrate our new shipping business. He got real drunk. And an hour later, he was puking blood. So, Afterlife hates humans. It's just that one Batarian bartender. He's got a stick up his ass about a bunch of Batarians that died a while back. No one does a thing about it, though. Humans ain't exactly held in high regard around here. Well, that human or that bartender's gonna fucking pay. <laughs> I think I'll go give that bartender a taste of his own medicine. He won't be expecting you. That's for sure. Give that Batarian bastard what he deserves. <laughs> yeah. I like that guy. All right, time to go confront the bartender about. So his... I woke up in a back alley. Uh, hi. It's the Vorcha. Uh, who? Uh, what the fuck is a Vorcha? <laughs> this is a Vorcha. I guess they added a bunch of aliens in that weren't in the first game. Yes, the couple of aliens that you hadn't seen because they live in the outskirts with all the scum. Oh, okay. Uh, who is Captain Gavorn? I don't know a Captain Gavorn. Why would I tell him anything? Not trust you. Tell Gavorn we know his tricks. We have not cure anyone today. How many Vorcha live here? There seem to be a lot of Vorcha on Omega. <sighs> Go away. Talk too much. Gavorn's fox get no more. We leave. Good talking to you. No more talk. We know Gavorn's tricks. We leave. Uh, okay. The fuck was that about? <laughs> Welcome to the Vorcha. All right. God, there were... Hey, salvage! Might I interest you in some salvage tech? Every credit goes toward a ticket to get me off this forsaken rock. Maybe we can cut a deal. I buy a lot of parts and equipment. Maybe we can make an arrangement. Well, you seem like a decent person, but you can't breathe a word if it's a Harry. Of course. Then we have a deal. Maybe I'll at least sell something to you. Uh, why are you here? What brought a nice kid like you to Omega? 
my pilgrimage. What money I had got stolen within a few days, so I decided to sell salvage parts. You can see how that turned out. Harrod's forcing me to sell high, and I can't even afford a ticket off this station. Tell me about Harrod. Why does Harrod control your prices? Harrod makes He's doing the same thing the Caden's doing. He's just looking at me every time I say something. <laughs> First, so it's his right. Well, no one will buy from me when he's so much cheaper. I can't save enough money for a ticket off the station. Mm, uh, let me talk to him. I could go talk to Herod for you. Get him to ease up. I won't stop you. If you can convince him to lay off, then maybe I'll get off this station after all. His shop's up the ramp, near where Marsh sells his goods. Anything you can do will be much appreciated. Okie dokie. I have to go. Please check with my kiosk to see what I have for sale. And thank you. Heavy weapon hey, ammo. the couplings! And the couplings that they yes! wanted. And I want more shotgun damage. Well, first we're gonna go beat the shit out of Harrod, and then we're gonna go beat up a bartender. <laughs> yeah, so many people are just earning your ire today. Uh, up this way? Uh, no, not that way. Where was he? Uh, right. Oh, that's Harrod! That's Harrod! Tentatively excited. Welcome, human. What can I get for you? Are you he's smoking? He's got a little cigar. <laughs> Do you literally have a little tiny cigar? <laughs> I... Tell me about your deal with the Quarian over there. Suspicious. He's got a tiny cigar! If I made such a deal, I would certainly not be inclined to discuss it. Accusatory. I don't understand how it is any concern of yours. Uh, you need to leave him alone. What if you and I make a deal? You let him set his own prices, and I won't break your legs. With barely contained terror, <laughs> you drive a hard bargain. <laughs> I haven't even started. Resignation. Very well. I will release the Quarian from his I, I don't know how that cigar is staying there, but I'm amazed! So there is no ill will. I offer you a discount on my own wares. Courteously, have a fine day. Take a look at my kiosk if you want to buy anything. Alright, you know what? You know what? Guest ship? Yeah, we'll get that too. Okay. We're going on a shopping spree! Just click We're it. it. Boys, we are getting all kinds of good shit today. We're even gonna get you a new eyeball. <laughs> Alright, well, let's go talk to what's his name and tell him that he is free to get whatever or to get a ticket out of here. Yeah, Ken will be happy to hear that. Ken! You can leave now! I heard you spoke to Harrod. Thank you so much. At this rate, I'll be off the station in no time. Good for you. Take care of yourself. You too. See, teach a man to fish and something. I don't remember how the rest of that goes. Yeah, so you have the option of giving him fish too, but I don't know if Corians can eat the fish. Yeah. Okay, well, let's go beat the shit out of the bartender! <laughs> right up there in Afterlife. It's gonna take the front entrance this time. Yeah, we'll go right in the front. Oh, is there a line? Do I have to wait in line? Let me in. I have to wait in line. <laughs> no, man, you're a VIP. You don't have to wait for the bouncer. Uh, oh, really? <laughs> God, I love these guys. Oh, uh, no, but seriously. Seriously, I'm going in now. Uh, who's this? What are you looking at? Uh, careful now. Don't you have something better to do than pick fights with people you don't know? No, just the ones who get in my face. You see my gun. Do you really want to do this? I, fine. You're off the hook. For now. See you around. I like how my Paragon options are like actually <laughs> really kind of mean. Yeah, they it's are. like that is super not a nice thing to do. It's not exactly. Yeah, it doesn't really seem one to one there, but whatever, it gets the job done. All oh, right, where is this bar? Oh, wait a minute! I saw something for a bottle of brandy. Where was that? Somewhere on the counter around here. Oh, oh, this way, this way, this way, this way. I know the bottle of brandy's here. Where is it? Yes, yes. Purchasing the brandy. Yay! I want to talk to you about this other bartender who's a racist. You're not a racist too, are you? Because I'm still thirsty. I still really want to drink. I'm going to walk away this time, but I'm gonna, I'll am gonna. i come back. You're a weirdo. After I beat the shit out of this other bartender, I'll come back. <laughs> I haven't seen any racists around here, human. You got an honest voice, so. <laughs> oh, yeah, there he is. Hello. Do I know? No, no, you humans all look the same. Here, have a drink on the house. 
I'm gonna incite the crowd. You could make him drink Oh too. my god! <laughs> you know what? Let's make him drink it! But, but you drank? You shouldn't get to. Wait, you don't want me to. Now, drink it. I... no. <laughs> drink it, or I'll blind you one eye at a time. Yeah, I'll make you look like this other guy standing behind me. <laughs> <laughs> Alright! <laughs> feel good about that. Not feel bad. real good about that. Yeah, that's good. That's a good idea. Alright, time to go dancing! <laughs> oh look, a dancer. Why would I why would I press A to watch? I'm just gonna I can watch from right here. You could press A to watch closer. Oh, that's okay. Wow, oh, they are really drunk. <laughs> Stacy! Come on, we're gonna go get fucked! <laughs> <laughs> they're not drunk, their inhibitions have been- Okay, yeah, they're drunk. <laughs> <laughs> uh, I feel That's good about what I did to you. Yeah! <laughs> yeah! Oh. I don't know who said that, but I agree with you. That Turian that was standing next to the counter. I can dance with a random patron for some yes, reason. Yes, you can! You can just do so much random shit in this game. It's so good. Hello, I have an important meeting with someone, and I will go this way. Are you the important people I'm here to speak with? Probably not. Uh, which one of you is the important person I- Oh! I did not realize this was here. <laughs> ah! There we go. That's close enough. Stand still. Uh, what's the scan for? If you're looking for weapons, you're not doing a very good job. Can't be too careful with dead specters. That could be anyone wearing your face. I was told you're the person to talk to if I have questions. They're clean. Depends on the questions. You run Omega? <laughs> I am Omega. Okay then. That seemed a little bit too theatrical for my taste, but sure. But you need more. Everyone needs more something and they all come to me. I'm the boss, CEO, queen if you're feeling dramatic. It doesn't matter. Omega has no titled ruler and only one rule. Don't drink at the bar from that one Batarian bartender. Well, you don't have to worry about him anymore. <laughs> yeah. Don't fuck with Arya. Oh, that's the new rule. Yup. That's simple enough. I like it. Easy to remember. If you forget, someone will remind you. And then I toss your sorry ass out the nearest airlock. So, what can I do for you? I guess Archangel first. I'm trying to track down Archangel. You and half of Omega. You want him dead too? Mmm, half of Omega? Why is everyone after him? He thinks he's fighting on the side of good. There is no good side to Omega. Everything he does pisses someone off. It's catching up to him. Well, I need him. I'm putting a team together. He's on my list. Interesting. You're gonna make some enemies teaming up with Archangel. That's assuming you can get to him. He's in a bit of trouble. Uh, where is he? Just tell me how to find him. The local Merc groups are recruiting anyone with a gun to help them take down Archangel. Sounds like that might be our ticket in. They're using a private room for recruiting. Just over there. I'm sure they'll sign you up. I need info about him. What can you tell me about Archangel? Not as much as I'd like. He showed up here several months ago and started causing all sorts of problems. If you make your own laws, which everyone here does, he makes life difficult. He's reckless and idealistic. But he seems to know enough to stay clear of me. What groups are after him? Which Merc groups are after Archangel? Blue Suns, Eclipse, Blood Pack. They're Omega's major players. Unless they're at war, you'll never see them together. But one thing they hate more than each other is Archangel. I bet Archangel is Garrus. What? Why would you think that? I don't know, because he's coming up with a bunch of laws and making people abide by them, and he's a loose cannon cop! <laughs> you might know who Archangel is. He might be a familiar sort. Alright, um... 
thank you. I appreciate the help. See if you still feel that way when the mercs realize you're here to help him. Morden! I'm looking for Morden Solis. Do you know where I can find him? The Solarian Doctor? Last I heard, he was trying to help plague victims in the quarantine zone. I always liked Morden. He's as likely to heal you as he is to shoot you. Hmm. That sounds interesting. There's a butt right over there. <laughs> yeah, don't forget the bosom. What can you tell me about him? Used to be part of the Solarian Special Tasks group. He's brilliant and dangerous. Just don't get him talking. He never shuts up. If you really need to find him, take a shuttle to the quarantine zone. No guarantee they'll let you in, of course. Thanks for the info. All right. Maybe I'll come back later. Maybe I'll be here. You maybe. Oh, you probably never leave that chair. Probably. I don't think she really goes anywhere else. Okay then. <laughs> the oh of, no! It was another Borcha! <laughs> a lot of drunk talk. <laughs> I've had enough of this. Let me inside or I'll smash that smelly ass you call a face. With barely constrained menace. Right. <laughs> Whatever. I don't want to go in there anyway. <laughs> I don't think reverse psychology is going to work on that guy. 